Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today just doing some street photography, A6400, Sony 85mm f1.8. And we're just going to go and see what shots I can take in the little Cotswold town in Morton in Marsh. So uh, I often walk the dogs around here a lot. I never stop to take any photos. And to be honest, my mind's a little bit of a blank. Let's see what we can find. So just walking into this little wooded forest area. And I basically wanted to see if we can find sort of a this using the path as a leading line through the woods leaves have started to fall quite like this actually with that tree as the focal point yeah that's nice so again here we've got another little pathway which i like these trees just in the front here i think they're a little bit distracting if we go up to the camera if we focus on that line these trees here, I think are a little bit distracting. So we'll go past those. Let's have a look what it looks like down here. So we're F 4.5. Lovely. So this is an absolute perfect example of a lovely little pathway, leading line, some nice overhanging trees. We're gonna shoot at F 13. I'm going to focus all the way down at the end on that fence. Try not to get the path, a bit more of the path in than the trees. Hopefully that looks all right. Now, anytime we can get a person in, it's always great to have a moving subject. I really like it. So what is, what's this bloke doing here? He's on his phone, he's walking along. You know, you see that would look better. F13. But I don't think that's going to be anything special. But just gives you an idea. So now we're just walking down onto the Cotswold High Street. As you can see, lots of traffic, lots of different photo opportunities, lots of people around, lots of visitors, residents. And I think first shot actually is going to be this Porsche. What have we got here? 911, that's a 991. An anniversary edition. 14 plate, could be Gen 1, could be Gen 2. For God's sake. 85 mil, absolutely screwing me. Hang on, I better get about 40 yards away. Otherwise, this is just not gonna... Don't know why I'm focusing down there. Let's focus on the glass. Perfect. So one thing I quite like to take photos of and, and like the look of is shop fronts. So any really nice, really interesting shop fronts I'd love to take a photo of. And there's actually one here of a furniture shop. I can't really get straight onto it because we've got this big massive tree in the way. But hopefully, hopefully can get something which I like the look of. Which to be honest, I don't think I will. It'd be better with someone passing. Ah, a little bit blurry, so the shutter speed wasn't high enough. So I've just noticed this like bell come tower thing, which I've never, ever, ever seen before. Nice. Oh, look at that tea room sign. Nice. See, I think the local hotel could probably make a nice picture. Looks like I'm not the only one. Again, I'm struggling with 85 now. Step back a bit, try and take the cars out. Focus on the window above. F1.8, nice. So, so far I'd say pretty unsuccessful on the photo front. A lovely place to live, but in my opinion, not the most photogenic in ways. But I do like that house there, F4. Lovely. Perfect. Church is just round the corner. We'll get some nice shots of that. Do you know what? I've just thought about it. I'm being a bit silly. With an 85 millimeter, I should definitely be focusing on details, close-up shots, not so much the, the more landscape element. Like for example, that is a nice front door. I'm gonna focus on the letterbox. Nice. So again, I'm really starting to like these plants, trees, shrubs, wherever they are growing up these houses. Again, focusing on the window, F2.8, 250th of a second. You know, earlier when I was like, oh God, 
That woman's a bit blurry, as in a long exposure. Uh, a long exposure. Sorry about the wind. That was because I got it at F13, so the shutter speed was 1 30th of a second. All a learning experience. So what's well, going to be a short video this week, because uh, so far I don't think I've taken any shots that people would deem portfolio worthy, but I guess that's part and parcel of just getting out here. The weather didn't look great. I couldn't really be bothered. But you know what? I've come out. It's now a lovely afternoon. The weather's nice. Lovely little stroll and I get a few photos. I may get some good photos. I may get some bad photos. Funny looks off the woman just closing the gate because I'm talking to myself. Yeah. Lovely. Glad I'm out. Now this has got all the bits and pieces I like. You know, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to come back a bit but I'll scratch my bag on the wall and then I'm going to focus on that window. F1.8, got a lovely wall for some separation. Perfect. So I'm now going to venture back down the high street with my newly uh, envisioned idea of taking more detailed shots. I'm going to try and get some more people action shots as well. So let's hope I can save this photo walk. Wish me luck. Ah, there's that uh, wheel thing again. Oh, tower. See if I can get that in without the scaffolding. Go for about F4. Nah, let's go F, F7, lucky number. Oh, I can't quite not get that scaffolding in. Hopefully in our picture anyway. And then back to this tower here with a clock on the front. Wow, a massive arctic comes and blocks it. Great. This could be a bit of a waiting game, this one. F4, as soon as it's gone, bang. We'll crop that one for sure. I don't want my Cotswold Chippy Norton sign there. Definitely crop that. It does seem that I've picked a day where there's serious traffic. And usually we'll get a lot of sports cars or some supercars, vintage cars. None of that today. We've got Golf and A-Class and a Mini Clubman. Also, I guess with the 85 mil, it allows me to get detailed shots, hopefully of someone having a coffee or something like that without actually getting that close. Well, these two gents here, definitely get a photo of these, but I'm not that close. Perfect. Hopefully some of these come out all right, who knows? Cyclists. As a cyclist myself, perfect shot. If it wasn't for another big lorry. See how that comes out. We really want to get a few more action shots, a few more walking shots. See what we can find. Just like that, perfect. Two guys decorating outside, one coming down the ladder. That's a great photo. Oh, he's nearly looking at me then as well. So close. <laughs> You're right. I'll pay for that. Oh, yeah? How much? <laughs> Perfect bit of banter as well. I love it. Right, getting ran over. It's going to be pretty tight though. Oh, this camera falls off the magnetic pendant. That's awkward. Oh, I'm a bit disappointed there's not more cars out. I picked a very traffic heavy day. I don't know what's going on. It's a Wednesday afternoon at. What's that, nearly 10 past one? No idea what's going on. Let's try and get a few more shots anyway before I head back. Should we get a nice shot here in the window of that girl cleaning and I've just been blocked and then she's finished. What about that lad? Yeah, that's, that's definitely not a pork shot photo shot. That's just a shot because I waited. Might even delete that. So just heading back now to what was probably a pretty unsuccessful um, photo shooting session. Um, but yeah, every day's a learning day. Hopefully there's one or two good shots. I'll get back, I'll edit them and uh, I'll put some final thoughts. I've definitely got some more thoughts on the 85 mil anyway. So I'll, uh, I'll share those, but um, yeah, let's just go back and edit. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, let me know what you thought in the comments of a little walk around Morton in Marsh. Whether you preferred this style of video, the walk around with the action two and a bit of talking, or maybe you preferred the 85mm uh, 
uh, other video that I've done that I'll link above where it's more a static approach and taking some shots, talking about where I am, etc. Let me know down in the comments which you prefer. Uh, let me know if you like any of the photos as well. Um, for me, I think there's maybe one or two, but nothing special today, but nice to get out either way. Please like the video, please subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll catch you next week.